Well, I think the, the footprint actually is a term that is well known today. And this is um, actually your own impact on the environment. Every person has a footprint. For example, I go to work with my car every day. So by this, I create a certain footprint. And of course, also a company has a footprint due to the production and the energy is used during production, the materials and so on. So our goal there should be to reduce this footprint as far as possible. But the good thing that is that we can also do something good, and that's the handprint. So the handprint actually describes measures that we take which help to decrease the footprint by, of somebody else or, for example, of other company. So um, for corner cranes, actually, this could be um, that we increase the eco-efficiency of our products, and thus we help our customers to reduce their emissions in their operations. I'm, I'm very sure that we have a very good standing regarding eco-efficiency. Again, here we can talk about a handprint and a footprint. So if you look at our footprint, our company is doing a lot for reducing our footprint and the footprint of our plant. We are eco-certified and we have, um, for example, in Finland, uh, we use renewable energy sources in our productions. Um, but I think the even a larger benefit of our um, company are the very eco-efficient products. I think we have realized many things that today maybe our competitors only talk about. For example, we have battery-driven vehicles um, where we have sold many hundreds of them and have uh, used them five years in, in operation. Almost all our products have been optimized regarding the diesel drives and we also um, have a wide range of hybrid products in our spectrum. And so we really look at what can be done in our products what are the technical measures for reducing the emissions of our product? And I think we are, yeah, technically wise, um, we have achieved a lot there in the last uh, 20 years.